doing swell I am my allergies are kicking my butt they started like acting up yesterday when we were moving the couches and now it's in full-blown effect so I am feeling not so hot um luckily two of my meetings actually got canceled so right now I'm like revising agenda I had a meeting earlier and then I have like a working session from two to three from 2 to 3 this afternoon so it should be a fairly chill day because it's only like 10 46 I'm gonna dip out of like probably like in the next 10 minutes or so to pick up some lunch just because like I need to get some fluid so I got like this elixir drink I got an agave charcoal lemonade um and then also I got a microgreen salad with like quinoa kale vinegar like all this stuff that'll hopefully make me feel better and I have a little credit too so that was good um but it's been a very slow morning they actually delivered the couch this morning which I'm so excited about it looks so good downstairs so I'll show you that later on me and Kendall need to like play with the layout a little bit so I'll probably end up showing you this afternoon because we need to like get things situated downstairs just like the layout the side tables we need to order another like floor lamp maybe actually two more just because that room is so dim so we're gonna do a little bit of a planning session tonight um, but yeah I you can probably tell like I've been sneezing snotting I took an allergy pill already so I can't take another one till tomorrow well till tonight because it's 24 hours but my eyes are red Bo's allergies were acting up so um, he's good right now his little eyes aren't red but he has a doctor's appointment tomorrow. He gets his other Parvo shot. So hopefully uh, he'll be able to go outside and we can go for walks because I know that he's going to enjoy that a lot. So actually during my meeting, since I didn't really need, I just had to listen on because it was a lot of like the pricey analytical people talking. So I just kind of listened on because I'm the communication side. So um, what I have to do is already done. So I just like attend the meetings to make sure here if there's any keywords i need to like jot down to like let the agency know but this is bo's doctor's appointment i have like a little checklist for like his allergies his eyes and his ears like if they have any over-the-counter or generic stuff that we can get him to like put in his food also they gave him like another like heartworm pill and i want to make sure i have that date correct so i know when to give him that in 30 days um his shots how many more he has left and when he can go outside his next appointment in time and then also green beans and squash as a snack because that's what we've been giving him because he loves you love green beans so we give him maybe like two or three a day and then squash maybe like once a week and we've had him for almost a month so he hasn't had too much of that but he has had a lot of green beans and he loves them so uh i just want to make sure it's okay to give him that many a day but his big boy teeth are coming in. He has an underbite and he is just, he's like laying right here because he's been going chaotic. So thank you. Oh, you're so sweet. You know, mommy doesn't feel well. So yeah, that is what we've been over up to over here. The couch is just so stunning. It's such a beautiful color. It looks so good with the walls and the carpet. So I'm excited to get that like sorted and planned. Um, but yeah. This is going to be a couple of days, maybe this weekend as well. We're going on a road trip Friday. We're going to Knoxville for the game. So we're going to spend the night in Knoxville and then we're going to turn around and on Saturday we're going to Huntsville uh, and then spending the night over there and then coming back on Sunday. So Bo will be at my mother's house and she is so excited to babysit and he's going to have so much fun with grandma. Um, but yeah. 
that is what we've been up to i tried to do like an aesthetic like morning like my coffee and breakfast and like typing and all that stuff and i was like that is not realistic to how i feel right now so this <laughs> this is what we're dealing with i'm glad i at least brushed my hair because honestly i didn't even feel like that i had like a cute I had a cute blouse on for my meeting. I was like, I am not gonna be on camera today. So we're gonna put a sweatshirt on. But um, yeah, I'm gonna go to the family shop later on to take some pictures for them for some of their product. Um, and then also I wanna plan a few sit down videos because I really enjoy doing sit down videos and they're gonna be like kind of one off type of thing. So like coffee, cooking and makeup. I'm not like super into makeup but I did get some new stuff. But I think cookie, cooking, cooking is like a good place for us to do like talking and having candid chats and cooking because I do so much of that, me and Kendall. And I think that'll be a good way for us to still do like the self-care type of talks that I used to really enjoy doing. So I'm gonna plan a few of those out as well. That is all the updates I have for right now. It's 10.51. Um, we did take our couch to Goodwill. Our sweet friend Chance came over with his truck last night and helped us get that big ass couch and it is finally gone. But I forgot to put the legs because I trailed them. So I forgot to put the legs, like give bring the legs and then give them the pillows. So before I go and pick up my food, I'm going to just run by Goodwill because she said the big truck comes around noon one. Um, and I want to make sure they have that. So when they put everything on the floor, like the person who will buy it from Goodwill, they have like the legs and stuff to go with it. But we did keep like the lazy boy and the ottoman. So yeah, I'm gonna drop that off and then go and get my food. And I'll show you what I got. Their food is always so yummy. So I'm gonna eat that and um, kind of monitor my emails. I need to finish that agenda. And then this afternoon will probably be like full force on computer. So at least I have some downtime. I might just rest um, and then hopefully feel better before the, the trip this week. So anywho. But I'm gonna put you in your little cage, okay? Yeah, cause mommy has to just dip out. And you don't like strangers. He doesn't like Chick-fil-A people. So, we're not going to Chick-fil-A. I'm not going to Chick-fil-A. I know you hate them, look at him. <laughs> He's like, Ma, I don't like them. They're worst. They're always so sweet to us. They always compliment me and mom, you and mommy. They always say how cute we are. I might put them in this little kennel up here and let them take a nap. And then when I come back, um, me, him and I could eat some lunch. He did go to the shop yesterday with Kendall and he was chaotic. So when I came back home from work, since we go to the office every Tuesday, uh, Kendall had to drop him off at like four o'clock because Bo was just going hot mess up there. He couldn't get anything done. And then when he's with me, he's like this. Cause he's a mama's boy. I'm sorry, mom. That's my baby. That's my baby. You help mommy so much. Yeah. Okay, I'm gonna put them up because I'm rambling. Um, and then I'll show you my food and stuff because it's always so good. We'll do a little taste test. And then we're gonna do as much as we can to relax. Feel better. Get ready for the weekend. For some reason in here, it is so yellow toned. Even though I got like the proper light bulbs, it's still kind of yellow tone. But I just picked up my food and I just fed Bo as well. Oh, it felt good to be outside, but then I was like, ooh, I should probably get back inside. But I was able to drop off the stuff I needed to at Goodwill and then also pick up my food. So I got the Don Kyoto's Elixir. And let me tell you what's actually in it. I ordered a new case this morning too for my new phone. In the last vlog, I unboxed uh, my, well not really unboxed, but um, I got a new iPhone yesterday. So I need to get a case and I really like case to five cases. So I just got like a cow print that was black. So you couldn't really tell unless like the sun hit it, you could see like the cow print, but it was pretty much just black. So the salad that I got 
It's a green micro machine. It has local microgreens, kale, quinoa, cherry tomatoes, goat cheese, roasted sunflower kernels, hemp seeds, toasted, uh, no, tossed in balsamic vinaigrette, truffle oil, and pink Himalayan salt. It is so good. I'll add probably just a little bit of seasoning, like some lemon pepper and some cayenne, but it's such a good salad, especially when you're not feeling too hot. It's really good. And this is the charcoal activated lemonade. It is like a, usually it's a little darker, but it's made with agave and it is so good. I'm going to drink some water as well. And then I'm looking on their menu for the Don Quixote's elixir. It's like... It's like a latte, but it's not. So this is a Don Quixote's elixir, and it's made with cayenne, maca, um, cacao, carobe, maple syrup, pink salt, vanilla, and almond milk. And it's so good. I'm like, should I drink this first, or should I drink my lemonade first? But I think I might save my lemonade for later. Oh, yeah, and sip on this right now. So I'm going to eat. Bo is like, Mom, you got to use a bathroom. He's like, mm, I don't want to go to the bathroom. But we try to make sure he like stays right there. So he like eats, use the bathroom, he can like go and play. So he knows the drill. He's just he's just trying to be all crazy because I'm vlogging. Who is that? I don't know. So who are these people? Who are they? Somebody's getting some. I'm gonna eat. Um and yeah, and just chill out. My next meeting is from 1 30 1 I think it's 1 to 3 so I have some time because it's only 11 35 I didn't get any emails I brought my phone with me while I was waiting for my food so um yeah I'll just monitor it I'm on my lunch break technically so I'm probably just gonna chill out even though I work from home I still like take time out to like have a lunch break and I'm like done with my day at five o'clock. I don't try to go over five, like the nine to five. I kind of treat it like an office job. So I do my work from nine to five, take my hour lunch break, take breaks when needed, get up and walk around and stuff. Um, but yeah, I still treat it like an office job, even though I work from home majority of the time. But I'm gonna eat, listen to Morbid Podcast because I was listening to that. It sounds like it's pretty good. And I'm probably just going to eat down here to be honest. I never sit at our dining room table that we like redid. So I think I'm going to sit here and eat. It's sunny and then let Bo like play a little bit and then go upstairs and have Sims on and do some work. So yeah, I'm sniffly but it was nice to be outside for a hot second. I'm going to eat. for our friends over at Merit and I thought that I would try it out on camera just because I just took a shower I washed my hair I did a little bit of my skincare and this is like an instant glow serum which I'm excited because I've been looking for some new serums to kind of replace some other ones that I use and what I really like about this I was reading it you can use it both in the night as well as the morning so I don't know if I'm gonna just use it in the morning like with work like working from home going into the office and stuff like that just to kind of give myself a little bit of sheen and glow or if I'm gonna do it at night but honestly I think I might do it during the day and make that part of my regimen just because I don't like to wear makeup really working from home and I think it'll still like give me that nice little glow but Merit is actually having a 20% um, sale going on this Black Friday with daily door busters and actually this great skin is going to be a part of that door buster let me grab my mirror so I can apply this and show you guys how it works. But um, early access starts Monday, um, November the 21st, and it's running through Monday, November the 28th. And this is the only sale that Mary is actually having this year. So on the box, it says to um, shake it up for four to five seconds, I believe. And then massage two to three pumps into skin after cleansing and before moisturizer. So I have my moisturizer right here. And I'm going to do one, I'm going to do two because it is kind of a liquidy consistency. But uh, this is the only sale that Merit is having this year. I really do like it a lot. I think it looks good. And this is a bare clean face so you can see kind of how the product lays on it. But I think it gives me that nice like glazed donut glass skin. 
and I love it I think it's really really pretty and then also with every first order with Merit you actually get this signature bag so I tested out some other makeup products from them not too long ago um this is the one that I currently use pretty much every day um I did have some concealer brow mascara as well as some bronzer I don't have those products anymore but this is my tried and true it's the raspberry beret cheek color and it is so gorgeous let me actually throw on some moisturizer i'm going to show you what it looks like on my skin and how it kind of applies with this sticky like serum that we purchased you actually get one of these little signature bags and i use this for all of my travels i've washed it i put it in the dryer as well and hasn't unraveled or anything like that but when i travel i just put like all of my makeup and all of my earrings and skincare and like perfume and stuff and i just tuck it into my checked bag but it keeps everything protected and it's just a really pretty like suede bag as well i'm just gonna go in with some of my moisturizer oh do you see that glow it's just a slight little highlight I think it looks really pretty. But like I said, everything is down below in the description box. If there's something that you might want to try, definitely make sure you use that code that they gave me for my friends over here on YouTube. But thank you again, Mary, for sending me over some products to test out. I'm excited within the vlogs to test it out a little bit more and kind of give you all a concise feedback within like the next couple of months to see how my skin likes it. But so far, so good. I like it a lot. It's a little sticky, a little tacky, but I kind of like that within my uh, serums. I feel like it lets the product kind of soak into your face and also it makes for applying makeup really good. But thank you guys and yeah, I'm going to get some stuff done and I will see you in a bit. this stuff up because he likes to lick the bricks and he also likes to go underneath the TV so we have all the candles right there and we have this up so he won't lick the TV Click. there we go there we go there we go that's a good boy hey Bo <laughs> handsome handsome
weekend you probably saw so many montage clips but this weekend me and Kendall went to Knoxville for my first balls game and then we spent tonight the night so Friday we spent tonight so we drove from our state to um well still same state but from Memphis to Knoxville spent the night had the balls game and then that night we went to Huntsville spent the night and then we came back yesterday so it wasn't like a big trip coming back it was like split up pretty well so yeah that's what we've been up to and then also new phone case I got this one off of case to and I really like it a lot it has like the cow print um and I wanted like a black case still because I had doing swell in the back but the etching was starting to rub off so I was like let me just get like a kind of plain print but it's still like a, a nice print and it's got the glass background so that came in and yeah that's about it little Bosif is right here he met his cousin Wimmy yesterday as well, which you probably saw. So we babysat Remy maybe like two months ago when he was fairly like, he's a puppy still, he's six months, but he was like a little puppy. And like babysitting him made us realize that we really wanted a dog. So Bo and Remy got to meet. And they played, even though Bo is a little bully. But he's a puppy. I think he's just like overly, he's very outgoing, very talkative. So he was like ready to play from day one with Remy. But Remy needed to warm up because he is a little bit more shy and reserved. But yeah, he had a great time at Grandma's this weekend. But I know she's glad to not have him in her house because he is a handful and then some. But today has been a very busy work day. Sorry, I'm just like sitting here and chatting, but honestly, I haven't really vlogged too much. My drink is in the living room. I don't feel like in here right now. But I need to get it because I need to show you the couches. So let me do that, and then I'll come back and then show you like the Trader Joe's because I got so many holiday things from Trader Joe's. Usually when I go in the afternoon after workouts, everything is like sold out, like picked out of stuff. Like things are picked over because people just come earlier in the day. But today, it was my day and I got to go early and I got a lot of good stuff. So I'm excited to show you what I got. I wish a little Bo Samson would move out my way. <laughs> He's just like, he falls right behind me, which I love. But when I'm trying to move furniture, it's a little inconvenient. And I don't want it to look too messy when I show you like the couch and stuff. Let me turn on some lights. And it's really blue because the kitchen is really yellow. So um, this is the new couch that I have been talking about this whole vlog. So after having it in our house for maybe like three or four days, we are actually going to add some pieces because this is a very huge room and as you can tell like it doesn't take up enough space over there we just have like some gaps that we need to fill so since we got rid of the blue well the blue couch is just up front since we have like two couches in here we need some more room so we're gonna add a piece right here and this is a custom one so we like customized it for this really pretty like sage color and it's so comfy as well but so we're gonna add another piece on this side because these two are attached but those are detachable and then those two are attached so we're gonna add another piece so this comes out to like right here and then we're gonna add another piece or two pieces so it extends all the way out to over there but honestly i love the couch so much it is so cozy it's great for like just chilling and relaxing it does make the room like so much more brighter because the couch before was very beige so it made the room like pull a lot of like muted tones but with this sage color which i hope comes up on screen um like it does in person it just makes the room so much more cooler and brighter and it just looks really good and if it fits everything perfectly so this is the couch that I've been hinting about for quite some time so you'll probably get another update about the couch um, in a couple of couple of months probably honestly because it's gonna take them a while to um, make the other pieces for it but I am really satisfied with it it's so cozy we legit I took a nap on this couch we've been watching like the Grizz games and stuff and watching like Great British Bake Show 
it's just the perfect couch to kind of sink into. And Bo is not allowed on this couch, but he is allowed on the ottoman. There we go, we're back, back in the sunshine. So um, yeah, I love the couch, it is so pretty, it's so comfy. So I'm excited that the house is slowly coming together. We're getting the room situated. Um, so we're gonna kind of focus a little bit more on the living room and the front room. Everything in the front room is pretty much stationary. We are getting rid of this Chester drawer over here this week. And then we're gonna put like a tiny desk over there and decorate it. And then um, what else that we're planning on doing this week? Oh, we're gonna like plan to like move Kendall's desk downstairs and keep my work desk up there. I think that's the idea. And then we're gonna get my old bedroom from my mom's house. So like my bed and my, he has a LaCroix box and he loves boxes so he's playing with that right now um and get like that stuff and bring it over so she can have that room for like work from home and like a guest room or anything that she wants the other room for so that is the plan and it's coming together which i'm really excited about but enough rambling let me show you what i got from the grocery store I got green beans because Bo loves green beans. His vet said they were a great healthy snack, but since he's a puppy, maybe like two or three a day, but nothing more than that. So he likes to eat and we also have some squash, so we'll just give them to him raw. Nothing like seasoning on or anything like that. It's just best to give them to him kind of raw. Um, so we have that. And also these roasted turkey and sweet potato. I like eating regular food for uh, breakfast. <laughs> I know a lot of people don't, but like this kind of stuff I will eat for breakfast. I don't really care for like the super sweet stuff, but I will eat it. But I like just regular savory stuff for breakfast. So I got two of these for me and Kendall. And then honestly, with the running around that I've done today, I went to the hospital, I went to Trader Joe's, I did all of my work early so I can have like time to like run errands and have my work phone. I have my laptop as well with me. Um, and then I went to Walgreens and then I went to AT&T to drop off my old phone and then I tried to go to the bank but the line was so long so I was like let me go inside. It was like 12 people ahead of me and all the stations were filled up too so a lot of people but with that being said I did get some salads and I'm glad I did because I got some to take for tomorrow so I think I'm gonna take this one the baby spinach and green salad for tomorrow just because I don't want to like continuously go out every week to lunch because I get bored of food I'm just like I can just have food that I bring so I think right now I might actually eat this one it's a broccoli slaw and kale salad with white chicken meat and I think that this will keep me full that's why I'm like I want to have the chicken because I go to cardio workouts in like an hour or like two hours in two hours I have workouts so they'll sit on my stomach pretty well um also got some croissants some more egg whites so I can make some protein waffles and then this pizza really good pizza and then also from Trader Joe's they had a bunch of holiday stuff so I got these Belgian cookie collection I just thought that these would be perfect to eat because we love baking shows and we're also going to try to bake this week as well so they'll probably be in the later on vlogs because Saturday I have a really exciting appointment you see me touching my hair? I got a really exciting appointment. It's, it's drastic, so I'm really excited. Um, but we're gonna do some baking this week as well. So um, I thought this would get us inspired, especially while we're watching stuff. Um, and honestly, they're just really good. I'm making excuses, but they're just really good. I love everything peppermint. Honestly, I keep saying honestly, but I got a peppermint mocha for the first time on Friday, like for the first time this year on Friday. Then I got one on Saturday and then I just got one today so I get it with oat milk but it is so good I love peppermint so I got this chocolate peppermint loaf it's basically like a cake but I figured that I could because you can make them into cookies so I was thinking about maybe making these into cookies um sometime this holiday season probably not this week because we have that big tin but I just want to have some on deck because we I like baking I want to be really good at baking and Kendall's really good at cooking so like we're a force to be reckoned with so I want to like test that out this holiday season also got us some wine 
Um, and then also these little soap bar sets, they were six bucks. But I was thinking like, you can actually like get those little gift bags are like really cute. You can put some like confetti in them or like wrap them up in like some Christmas holiday paper and give these out as gifts. So like $2 a piece for a set of soaps. But you can give them like individually to someone separately. So this is charcoal and tea tree, the black one. Coffee bean and then lavender and eucalyptus, which is my fave. So I think I might, if they have some more, maybe later on this week, because I am going shopping with my bestie on Sunday. If they have some more of these, I probably will get two more and just make like little bags to give to people at work. Or I can just like put them in people's stockings. So that is my plan for that. My medicine. Hey, what are you doing? Bo Samson. Hey, stop that. He's going crazy. Um, pumpkin blondies. We'll probably eat these before the cookies because they expire quicker. Some persimmons. Got two persimmons. One to take to work. Some granola bars. And then also I got us two Indian meals. So I got kennel the lamb because I don't do lamb. I don't. I don't. So I got myself the vegan one and him the lamb one because I didn't know he loved lamb and apparently he does. So got him that and then also got some little quiches to have. So I got a few holiday things like three, four, five, six, six things the holiday-ish. So um, this is very holiday. These burritos are roasted turkey and sweet potato, seasoned white turkey meat, sweet potato, cranberry salsa, and a rice flour tortilla tortilla so i'm excited about that but honestly there's nothing else that's going to be going on today i probably will pick up the vlog tomorrow with my like two hours that i have of time before i go to workouts i have a research paper that i need to like write it's due wednesday um but my goal is to just finish it tonight like finish the whole thing tonight and then maybe tomorrow go through and add the notations and maybe read through it once more and then submit it and then also, uh, that's like my big thing that I need to do tonight. And that's all that I'm going to be doing this afternoon. So it's not going to be anything. You're not going to miss anything other than like me telling you the workout stats. And then us cooking and then me writing a paper. So it's going to be very chill on this end. So I think that I might wrap up the vlog. And then I'll pick it back up tomorrow. Because we are presenting to the vice president tomorrow of uh, global marketing. So I'm really excited about that. Um, so that's tomorrow. We have a potluck at work tomorrow afternoon. So I'm getting a sweet tea, like a big jug from like a local place is so good. So I'm getting that for us. Um, and then we have friends coming over tomorrow with their dog. So Bo gets to meet another dog tomorrow. Uh, he's older. Wesley's like 10 or something like that nine or ten they don't know they found him on the street so he's older um so you can see me him tomorrow and then i'm just trying to bring you through so you can like subscribe and stick around i have my hair appointment on saturday which is going to be so drastic and i'm like should i vlog separately for that or should i just include it within like a weekly vlog but it's gonna be a lot of different like stuff that usually my lifestyle vlogs revolve around and some fashion stuff too but I'm going to end the vlog right here. We're going to eat some lunch and we're going to chill out and write some papers. So thank you for hanging out these last few days. I know it was a little bit all over the place towards the end of the vlog, but you know, life happens and you don't feel like pulling out your camera because you're having fun. And that was definitely these last couple of days. So um, I like to pull out my camera when I feel like it. Um, but if it's just like a lot of fun, like last weekend we went to escape room and Allie went to dinner. We did a lot of things that I didn't document at all because sometimes it's just nice to be in the moment. So hope you understand, I know you do. But I'm going to end the vlog off right here because I don't have much time and I wanna spend some time with my Bosif and eat and kind of chill out before workouts. So he likes my earrings. We will see you later. And you'll see Kendall in the next vlog. You saw him in this vlog, but you know what I mean. You'll see him later and you'll see us later. So bye, go say bye. Hey, hey, tell him bye. Right there in the camera. Say, Mom, no. <laughs> Bye. <laughs>